Here I am, Amulya Sood of Flash Gen Thay with my project report of maths on the topic Historical Monuments, for which I have selected Padmanabha Swami Temple at Tiruvanthapuram. Padmanabha Swami Temple was built by one of the most powerful rulers of Travancore dynasty, Raja Marthanda Verma in 16th century. It lies 8.4 kilometers away from the seashore of Arabian Sea in the Indian state of Kerala. Padmanabha Swami Temple has a fusion of Trafadian and Kerala architecture. It has a height of 100 feet and covers an area of 8 acres. There are 4 entry gates from all the 4 directions and 7 chambers or vaults. The area covered by the temple is in the shape of rectangle. It contains seven chambers out of which six were full of gold, diamonds, gems, etc. And in one chamber there was the head of the king of Travancore dynasty. It is the richest temple of the world as it was found full of gold and gemstones, which worth one trillion dollar. The temple has an image of Lord Vishnu, sketched with 12,000 fossilized shells of Kandaki River. The temple has a corridor of 365 meters and one quarter sculptured granite stone pillars with elaborated carvings. There is 18 feet long Vishnu idol. There is a pond inside the campus. The temple also has a dress code that is dhoti for men and sari for women. The temple is seven storied. There is a story behind the construction of the temple. The story is that a tree fell on old Vishnu temple. People carved the tree into the statue of Lord Vishnu, but only navel of the idol was visible at Tiruvanthapuram. Devotees requested Lord Vishnu to reduce his size. The wish was fulfilled and Lord Vishnu reduced his size. A new temple was created by Raja Marthanda Verma to keep the idol of Lord Vishnu now which is known as Sri Padmanabha Swami Temple. Thank you and have a nice day ahead.